In this video, I'll be showing you how to verify what specific activities took place on a specific device. If, for example, you want to verify or check as an IT system administrator what happened in a specific device, which activity actually took place on that device, let me show you how to do that from your Azure Active Directory Admin Center. So right now, in, from your Azure Active Directory Admin Center, just go to Azure Active Directory and then scroll down and under monitoring, you have sign in logs and audit logs. So just click on audit logs. And here it says the last 24 hours. So I'm going to just select that and we can actually create a custom time interval. But let me just select for the last one month and then click apply. So by clicking apply, you can see we have some filter that has actually been selected for us. But we can decide to add a filter. For example, I can decide to just add status to it. And then here we can now see what activities took place on what day. Here you can see, for example, on the 11th, which is actually today, you can see device registration service key management read bit locker key. It was actually performed, initiated by Kelvin Johnson. And also you can see it says device no longer no longer compliant which was actually initiated by Microsoft Intune. You can see that Microsoft Intune updated device, updated device, and here device no longer compliant. So when I scroll down, you can see all the different activities that actually been performed on that device. For example, I read a BitLocker key on a specific device registration service. And also when I scroll down, you can see that it says I am I add group to a Windows 10, which was performed by me. So definitely you can see all the different activities which actually happen to a specific device. And not only the device, but also to some application. Like for example, I was add, I add um, a user to a group or add a device to a group. You can see it was also registered here on our audit logs. And if I scroll down again more, you can see we have some extra information. For example, it's a registered connector. It was actually uh, initiated by this account. So now it's going to actually give you a detailed information of who performed that activity, which account actually performed that activity. When we scroll down more, you can see we I think I can still actually load more to get more information of what and what happened on my device. Here you can see it says we had um, a sync actually took place. Um, change user's password was actually done by NDES. Thank you very much for taking your time to watch this video. And please don't forget to subscribe to my channel. And if you think this video can be of help to anyone, you are always feel free to share my video to that person. Thank you very much for your time and goodbye.